Welcome again to my channel. My name is King Ink, and today I'm feasting on the Trader Joe's birria. Really good. Oh my gosh. So excited. I took a bite for TikTok, but it's for you guys. I'll show you the packaging in a bit, but it's a soft stew meat. I added onions, uh, lime juice, cheese, and some extra red chili. Mm. Okay, okay. What about me though? Are you gonna make a move for me or no? And I made these little tacos. Mm. Okay, just put okay. some cheese in there, put it in the air fryer. What were you thinking about over there? Like just not helping me at all? Oh, mm. so you got them you got them bunnies. You got bunnies too. Runs in the family. You know what I'm saying? This is gonna be a Those must have eggs. every day in my freezer now. Yep. I'm not what even gonna lie. Like, um, Literally, the pieces of meat dill. are so savory, place, so dill. soft. You can make bro, this in the microwave, te meat technically, meat but like I defrosted this so and put this on the stove. Mm. Nice. And oh my gosh, you guys. No Literally no unmatched. Here's I'm the fresh tortilla. I think it's I still know, bro, on enough for a bit of a cheese bowl, so. Watching Burleazy like like play like Little Nightmares like in the background. The Dude, that was. game, best game. So easy. Good serving. Very savory. You could have it as just like a beef stew. Put it into tacos. Dip quesadillas in it. Mm. It was, um, I think $7.99 at Trader Joe's. And I'm happy because it's not a seasonal item. So especially with fall, at least the Halloween time going away, it's not gone. Mm. But Trader Joe's comes in clutch. I thought it was one of those stories that was like one million billion dollars. Oh, I get it. I cannot start going in the water until he's actually living in my area. Otherwise, I'm cool. It's not too bad for certain things. Yep, just like this, just like this. When he, when he had over, yep. They're really nice ready-made meals. You thought, you thought, you thought, get mixed. No, I'm away. Okay, okay. You try me. I also like the dog chews that they have because Opal really likes the Himalayan yak chews that are like this dry cheese that I put in the microwave and turn it into like a, a big cheese puff. Mm. They have a lot of different types of cheese. Their spooky selection of like ciders are really delicious though. Once I turned 21, I was like, give me that, give me that crazy apple juice. And it's been like that ever since. I'm sorry. Beer tastes fucking whack. Will I continue to try new ones? Yes. I won't buy them again though. So far, I wish to be proven wrong. Follow me, follow me. Nice work, nice work. Oh, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, I need everything to do with this one. But guys, rating on this, this is a freaking 9 out of 10. And I only say that because I wish it was spicier, but I added, I added some red chili. You got to that shit perfect. Mm. I definitely want to try more of the foods from Trader Joe's because this is incredible. Mm. Has a nice peppery taste. Garlic, oh, onion. Bad, bad. Very has like this like sharp taste to it. That's why it complements like 
the lines do so well, I think. Been doing a lot of cleaning today, and I'm very happy about it. And I want to print out some prints to put in the kitchen so that I have like prints and decorations in the kitchen. I'm just trying to figure out what vibe. Because I like orange, but I can't just pick anything orange because then it looks ridiculous to me. I gotta be meticulous about it. The best. This is the container that it comes in, so you can microwave this, but I just used it as a bowl to not mess up dishes. Oh my gosh. Mm. All these spoons that I have, the wooden ones, they're from Trader Joe's. You can get them at the end of the checkout line. But that's going to be it for today, you guys. Just finishing up the little bottom here. If you haven't already, please go ahead and hit that follow, that subscribe button. And make sure to leave a chili pepper emoji in the comments so that I know you made it this far. Trader Joe's birria. Fucking delicious. Make stew with it. Use it as a base. Pop that shit in the microwave. Put it on the stove. I recommend to definitely add onions, cilantro. I just didn't have any right now. Onion, cilantro, lime juice. Add some spice to it. I'm not gonna lie. That's the only thing. It's not like really spicy. So flavorful. I added a little bit of water. So even within that, it wasn't as concentrated as it was like straight out of the package. So I'm sure it'll have more flavor if you just like only heat up what's in the package. If you like only heat up what's in the package. But I thought it, there there is definitely not a lot in here. It's like, it really is just like one or two Church servings, like depending on how you cook it. Oh my gosh. Dude. After a long day of cleaning, which thankfully hasn't taken too long, because... I was doing the method of like, oh, only clean a spot for 10 minutes. And no matter what, after those 10 minutes are done, you stop. Because I have this issue of wanting perfection all the time. And so it definitely stops me from just trying things. Because every time I'm like, oh, I don't have enough time for that. That'll take me like this long. Oh, this is too much. It's like overwhelming. I'm the type that definitely like burns myself out all the time and then i wonder why i'm having like a bad time all the time so figuring it out had a big cleaning day and oh my gosh food this is perfect this is perfect for when you don't want to cook a big ass meal but you want something cozy and comforting like this was a yes if you haven't already please go ahead and hit that subscribe button my name is king inc i just be trying new things every day may that be with my activities places i go foods i try i just like to show you guys because i'm at a point in my life and I have been since I was like 17, thankfully, gratefully, where I'm allowed to do things on my own accord. It's my choice and I'm so happy to have this freedom because I had a very, very like harsh household that I was able to basically escape. So we're figuring out my journey together. We're figuring out like being 23 forward on this channel. So thank you guys. I hope you guys have a great one. Check out all my social media down below and follow me on everything. And I hope you guys have a great one. Bye-bye.